Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. All right, so today's video is going to be um, a little bit of a few things that have been going on. I know that you guys have seen my absence here on the channel, and so I wanted to come on and explain that and try to do this without crying. So, as many of you know, my husband has been battling brain cancer. He had uh, a type of brain cancer called glioblastoma multiforme, and he was diagnosed with this cancer about 13 months ago. Now, I knew that when he was diagnosed with this, that there really was not much of a chance that he would be around for very long. Um, he actually did very, very well up until January of this year. And then in January, he started having symptoms again. He was still continuing with treatment. We were going every two weeks to um, a local hospital here where he was getting a chemo infusion every week. And it was working really well. He, up until January, he was working his normal schedule every day. Um, he was different from, even from 13 months ago, you know, kind of before that, I noticed that he was different. It was just, his personality was different and things about him were very, very different. Um, and then of course, once we got diagnosed or once he got diagnosed, then I, everything kind of came together and I realized why he was different, and it was because he had a tumor in the left temporal lobe of his brain. Um, he went through radiation, and he went through chemo, and like I said, was doing well as far as functional-wise up until January, and then started having symptoms, had progression on basically the last type of chemo that they could try on his particular cancer. So at that time, I knew that um, our time was short and it was limited, although I had been knowing that really from the beginning. He did lose his battle with this awful bastard of a cancer. Um, and he is no longer with us. So I, I didn't want to come on here until I knew that I could keep it together in order to talk to you guys. I definitely wanted to tell you what was going on and to let you know that that is the reason for my absence from the channel. Um, however, I am I'm back. I'm getting back slowly into my routine. I went back to work this week. Uh, there wasn't really a whole lot of time that I took off. Um, I just worked around him and who could stay with him. And he really did well up until the end. Um, the end was very, very peaceful. And I am very, very, very thankful for that. It was something that I have been worrying about for 13 months. It, it was something that I stressed over and worried about constantly. And I am very happy to say that the end was peaceful. So, I don't wanna come on here and, you know, be a downer because this is not what my channel is about. It's not what I am about. I am a very positive person by nature and I definitely, um, do not want this to kill me too. And I refuse to let it kill me too. So I'm gonna do what I can do to move on and move past this and, you know, live my life um, like I know that he wanted me to live it. So that's all I wanna say about that. Um, I don't wanna get on into too much because then I'll start crying and Nobody wants to see a crying face. So that is all I'm gonna say about that. Just respect my privacy, please, on this matter. Um, but I did feel like, you know, you guys have been with me through everything. And especially now that my channel will be changing a little bit in content, I 
I didn't feel it was right to just jump on into my normal videos without kind of coming and having a little heart to heart with you guys, letting you know what's going on in my life. And you know, if there are lapses in times between videos, you understand why. I am gonna try not to let that happen because really my best therapy is staying busy. So the busier I am, the less I have to think about it and the, the more um, productive I can be for everyone involved. So I you know, am getting back into um, doing what I have to do, full speed ahead. So that is, again, I know I said that before, but that's all I wanna say about that. Um, the second thing I wanna talk about is the channel change. So I know that some of you have seen, or most of you actually, have seen the new channel logo. And part of the reason why I went with Simply Rocks is because I knew that there was gonna be a new season in my life coming and I just wanted it to be about everything that I love, I don't like, um, you know, about Stasi and Harper, and about my posh business, my photography business, vacation vlogs, just simply rocks. So I thought that that was kind of something that just summed it up, what I want this channel to be. And I'm gonna share what I wanna share, when I wanna share it. If it moves me to come on and talk to you guys, I'm gonna do that. Um, you guys know that I am very, very transparent. I try and be who I am in front of the camera and in front of everyone. And it's just simply me. So I, that's why I chose Simply Rocks. Um, so hopefully I will get back into, you know, some Stasi videos because I know that most of you are always, you know, chomping at the bit to have more Stasi videos. And I promise I am not going to stop doing Stasi videos. They may be a little less than what it was in the beginning because like I explained before, there are so many things that I have done already and it would just be redundant to keep on doing the same types of videos. I know that you guys have said, you know, do a bow video. Well, I haven't gotten any new bows in months and months and months. So the last bow haul that I got, I, I did a video on it and I continue to do so. So if I do get new bows or if I do get a new storage system, I'll come on here and tell you guys about it. But for now, everything is about the same. We are doing the same thing um, that we have always done with grooming, with bathing on both Harper and Stasi. So look through that playlist and anything new that comes up, I will definitely bring it to you. I am still doing my photography business and that is still going really well. And thank goodness I have both my photography business and my perfectly posh business because throughout this whole ordeal, if I didn't have my work to keep me busy, then I probably would have gone crazy. So that definitely has helped. It has helped me coming on doing videos for you guys and also on my Facebook um, VIP group with Posh. That has kept me really, really um, thinking about other things rather than the reality of life, which for the past 13 months has pretty much sucked. Um, so I, I thank God that I had my channel, you guys, perfectly posh, my photography business, and of course my family and friends as well. Now, one more thing that I did wanna say, and I know this video is encompassing a lot of different topics, but I wanna get back into filming content. So I wanted to get all of this out of the way before I really you know, dove in and did some more content videos, which I'll probably do a separate video on um, this subject that I'm getting ready to talk about. But I did earn the trip to go to Greece. So I know that a lot of you have placed orders, have followed me along in this journey on going to Greece, and I will be vlogging that trip, which will be in June, and so stay tuned for that. And I am gonna bring you a video all about basically me 
you know, how I earned it and how I, you know, earned this trip to Greece um, pretty soon. So stay on the lookout for that. And that is it for this video. I, I, I know that I'm kind of like, oh, uh, you know, but I wanted to get this out of the way. I wanted to come on and just talk to you face to face, tell you what's going on. And now that this is done, we can move forward, right? So thank you for joining me. Thank you for listening to me. And um, just thank you for being here. Because even though, you know, most of us have, or probably all of us have not met, I do feel like I know a lot of you guys through this awesome community of you know, YouTube and my channel, and I appreciate every single one of you. Now, I do still have the VIP group on Facebook, and I will leave that information below. If you're interested in joining me on Facebook, I am a lot more active on my VIP group than I am on, you know, on here on YouTube. And Snapchat, I, I did Snapchat for a while, and I really loved it but I found that it was taking up so much of my time. So I'm really not active on Snapchat at all anymore. Every now and then I'll think about it and do a little snap. And I really loved it when I was doing it, but it was a time suck. And it was like, oh, you know, Snapchat and Facebook and Instagram. And it, it just, it gets a little bit too much at times. And with everything that was going on, it just got to be too much. So that, you know, I really have not, active on Snapchat anymore. So if you were following me there, that's kind of the reason why I kind of dropped off the face of Snapchat Earth. So, all right. Thank you for watching and I will catch you on the next video. Bye guys. Have a great day. Bye-bye.